Aaron, it seemed like a, a complete team win tonight, starting with the pitching. Just what did you think of the effort from everyone from Montgomery on? Yeah, just a solid performance, like you said, all around. Um, guys going out there doing their job, hitting their spots, um, limiting damage when guys, you know, there were a couple innings there where guys got on base, and, uh, you know, being able to limit damage is, is, is always key, especially when you get a couple guys on and no outs. Uh, usually a crooked number goes up there. And then, you know, all the way down to, you know, Severino making an appearance and uh, long awaited. You know, I, th I know the fans were excited about that, and, you know, so were we as teammates. It was. Uh, Pretty, pretty special having him back. He's a big piece of this team, this organization. So, um, you know, hoping, hoping to build off this great, great outing he had. Aaron Boone said you guys gave him a belt in the clubhouse. Just what was said there? What, what was the reaction like when he came back in there after how long it had been since he had been on a major league mound? Yeah, it was, it was, it was a good time in there. You know, I'm not really gonna go into details. You know, it's a special, special room to be in. Um, but it was, you know, just. Like I said, he's a big part of this organization, big part of this team, and uh, he's been missing for a while. But it's it's a long recovery trying to come back from Tommy John, and um, just you know happy he's back, happy he's healthy, and you know we're, we're going to need him down this stretch. I know that. Double in the first inning, and then obviously the homer that gave you guys a, a little bit of a cushion there in the seventh. Anything different about your approach or any adjustments at the plate coming in tonight? Into tonight? Uh, not really. Uh, I think past couple of weeks I've been kind of a little too much in my legs, uh, making too much movement. So I just try to simplify my move. And when I simplify my move, it just makes it a little cleaner. And, you know, one thing that helps is the guys in front of me keep getting on base. You know, that's always, always makes my job a little easier. Go to Bruce Beck. Aaron, when you stand and Gallo all go yard, how dangerous is this lineup? Oh, it's uh, one of the best in the games, um, you know, just all around, you know, Stanton comes up with a big knock, hit it about 130. <laughs> I feel bad for the fans sometimes, um, you know, Gallo, another moonshot. It's just, it's just um, this shows what this team can do. You know, we can go up there and we can score runs uh, by, you know, getting on base, a couple singles. Um, we also, if you leave something over the middle to some of our big guys, you know, they're going to do damage, you know, and, um, you know, it's just always fun to see that, especially when all the guys are kind of clicking like that. Aaron, how are you approaching the stretch drive with 10 games to go? Oh, this is, this is fun. You know, this is, um, you know, in, in years past, uh, we've kind of already, at, at this point, kind of known where we're going to be. You know, you kind of know, okay, we're going to be in the wild card game. You know, we're going to be at home during the wild card game. You know, we're going to be playing the division series at home. You, you, you know, we kind of already had a plan, but this year it's uh, a little different. You know, we don't know. You know what's going to happen. You know it's all kind of in our hands, like I said the other night, and that's you know that's that's where you want to be as a competitor, and um, you know just as a professional, that's that's you know you want to be holding the cards, you want to be out there, you know, controlling it, and you know this is this is gotta go out there and have some fun and you know win some ball games.